Hi guys, good morning. I actually fell asleep with my makeup on last night and so I now have like no eyelashes because every time I fall asleep with mascara on, I always like pull at them. Lovely. Anyways, we are going to be getting, I can't talk. We are going to be getting ready um, quickly. I'm not gonna do like a full face of makeup. Um, just because I still have makeup on, call me gross, I'm going to just put my more makeup on, I'm not going to wash it off. Um, and I've been using this NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop um, Full Coverage Foundation, and I absolutely love it. It's probably my new favorite foundation, um, and so yeah, we're just going to use that. A um, little bit of eyeshadow mascara and um be on our way okay i am ready and i thought i would show you guys my outfit this top is from walmart i got it back in the fall so i don't know if it is still available but it still fits me so that's good maternity leggings probably doesn't go together or match but i don't care it's cold out we have socks and my boots and so yeah that is my outfit, I am 27, here, let's see, it's kind of hard to show you guys, 27 weeks pregnant. I am just going to, my lips are so dry by the way, I am going to go make a quick iced coffee, I've been getting into iced coffee recently, again, thank goodness, because I prefer an iced coffee over a hot coffee, um, but I mean, I'll still drink both, but I prefer an iced coffee over a hot coffee, and at the beginning of my pregnancy, I just could not have iced coffee. It literally made me sick, made me gag, like I couldn't even look, or the thought of iced coffee made me sick, and so thankfully, I'm getting back into it because I love iced coffee, um, and so yeah, I'm going to go make one so I don't have to buy one, you know, save some money. Um, I'm going to go make one. I'm going to get the kids ready, get their shoes on. We're going to be going to Walmart and Target. You guys um, saw the title of this video. It is a stocking stuffer video for um, our kids. So if you're new, we have an 8-year-old, a 6-year-old, a 4-year-old, and a 2-year-old. So, um, And we don't do like, we don't go crazy with stockings, honestly. And so it's kind of minimal. We'll see. I haven't even gone shopping for them yet. So, um, and yes, I'm bringing my four year old and two year old because I, I mean, I kind of have to. So, um, yeah, we are going to make a coffee and then we are going to be brought up to the store. So for my iced coffee lately, I've been getting these Starbucks um, frappuccinos. So, this one's just regular coffee. Um, I'm going to go with the mocha because you guys know that I've been like obsessed with mocha and the peppermint mocha elf who's that what the play the switch oh you need to wash your hands yeah okay go wash your hands then you telling weston he needs to wash his hands okay go wash your hands okay when you're all done and then you got to flip your shirt around because it's on backwards yeah yeah. Well, this probably already has like a creamer in it, but don't judge. I like a little bit of extra. It just tastes so good. Plus, when you think about it, when you go to like actual Starbucks, they add so much extra stuff that me adding a little bit of extra creamer is not that bad. Like I was honestly shocked when I saw how they made a caramel macchiato at Starbucks. Like, completely shocked. If you've never seen, like it's literally the smallest amount of coffee and the rest is like all milk. So, and if you guys are wondering, if you're new to my channel, I get my cups, like my Starbucks cups like this off of Etsy, so. No, you're not having a fruit snack. You already had one. It's not. It's the elf on the shelf gummy bear. I think it's fruit snacks. Yeah, and we have that book. Yeah, can we get off the floor? Thank you. And look inside. Yeah, there's a little activity. That's cool, huh? And if we open it, it'll be good.
all these cocoa melons. Yeah, but you have the color. Yeah. You don't have Look at cocoa melon, a little blind, a little blind bag, blind I ball. I have all of the stocking stuffers right here. I shoved them into this one bag from Target and from Walmart. Like I said, I don't want to go too over the top. There's also stocking stuffers in here for Gage, but I'm not done with his stocking yet. Um, also, we still need to get, Gage likes to put a Hot Wheels car in the, all of the kids' stockings, and I totally forgot about that. So I do need to go back to the store before Christmas and pick up little Hot Wheel cars. Also, if you hear a fan, I need that going, you guys. Like, I am hot, I'm out of breath, but we're just gonna dump this big. We're just gonna dump it out, and then we're just gonna go from there if it will dump out. <laughs> Hold on, there, oh my goodness. Remember in the beginning of this video, I said we don't do much candy. I'm not gonna do much candy yet, yeah, well, mm -hmm. Okay, anyways, I'm going to separate it all and then I will show you guys. Honestly, it's really not that much, but for some reason I felt like my cart was getting full which, I mean, understandable with four kids. Um, but yeah, we still need to add the Hot Wheels car, like I said. Um, and so I'm just going to get started. As you can see, everything I try to keep similar, if that makes sense. Like, not the same thing, but similar. So we're going to start youngest to oldest. Hold on. So for stocking stuffers, too, it's more of like your essential needs. Toothbrushes, bath stuff, that kind of thing that kind of stuff. I do try to steer away from um, adding like a bunch of like toys or like electronics. Um, same with candy, but I did get a little bit more candy um, this year, but it's okay. So we're going to get started. My kids love loofahs. Charlie does not have a loofah. And so I saw this Coco Melon one and I thought he would love this. This is from Walmart. Um, and so I picked him up a Coco Melon loofah. The older kids all have their own loofahs, and so I thought, might as well just get them another one. Um, we switch them out, I think, once a month. And so these are fun little character ones. They just usually have, like, the dollar ones. Um, and so they'll love these. This one is Weston's. It is Rebel. And then we have Chase for Noah. And then Maya's isn't a character one, but it's the brand. It's from Target, More Than Magic this pink one it's super pretty i said sorry if i'm out of breath um okay and then picked up these money santa chocolates these are from target so each of the kids all got one which they'll love because what kid doesn't love chocolate then picked up these krabby patty like gummies my kids love spongebob absolutely love spongebob these are from walmart i remember having like a gummy krabby patty growing up and i didn't like it so i don't know if my kids are gonna like it but we'll see so they each got one of those they each are getting a brand new toothbrush this is just from the brand spin brush this one is mario for charlie this one is Jurassic World for Noah. We have Spider-Man for Weston. And then, of course, LOL for Maya. This is not Spin Brush. This is the brand Firefly. So hers was a little bit more expensive, but they didn't have any that she would like in the Spin, in the spin Brush um, area. So these were $5 from Walmart, and I believe this was like $5.25. Um, also from Walmart. Now they each are getting a little toy, which is a little bit different for each of them. So Noah and Maya are getting the mini brand toy surprise balls. Absolutely love the mini brand food. And this is the toy one. So picked one up for Noah and then picked one up for Maya as well. They also had these mini blippy mini hero surprise boxes and so this one is going to go to Weston and then Charlie he is just not into like the mini brands I mean he thinks they're cool but he's just not like that's not his first pick and so I found this Coco Melon app bracelet all of this stuff um the toys so like 
the toy mini brands and then the blippy like surprise box plus the coco melon slap bracelet are all from walmart um this was not in like the toys or the stocking stuffers this was actually in the party section like the birthday party section you guys remember i tried to find a coco melon themed birthday for Charles and of course they didn't have anything but now there's so many um, birthday party supplies for Coco Melon and one of the things in there was a slap bracelet so I thought that would be really cute as a little stocking stuffer for him each are getting a bath like bath slime bath toy or like bath bomb older boys are getting this Crayola bath slime this is just the blue berry, blue scented soap. And then Weston is getting the cherry berry slime. It is more into bath bombs. And this one is from Target. It is the More Than Magic brand. And it's just a little seashell. And then Charlie, he, when it comes to bath time, he's very picky about what toys he has in there, as well as bubbles and this like slime stuff, or even like the bath paint we've had. He hates it. And so... I picked up the Mr. Bubble Fizz tub colors because he does like this. I wanted to try to find the Crayola tub color, but they did not have any. So we're just going with the Mr. Bubble. And the last thing we get every year are these little candy cane Hershey's. Um, and so all of the kids got one of those. So I feel like it's a good amount. It's not over the top. It's just a small little stocking stuffer gift for all the kids and i'm sure they will love it and on to my husband's i am not done like i said but i wanted to show you um we go with the same theme with like the kids like your essential stuff like bath shower you know that kind of thing um and so i picked up a um, hair like paste he uses the dove and that one is almost gone so i picked up this old spice for him to try Hopefully he likes it. This one is from Target. And picked up a new loofah for him. And then this toothbrush. And then just some like random. There's just so many random things. And then I picked up this Bic lighter. So like I said, I need to go and get the rest of his things. I think I'm going to put in like a car freshener. Like an air freshener. He really loves the Old Spice. Um, and yeah, I'll figure it out. But for now, that's what I got showing gauge everything that I got for the kids yep. and just remembered that we forget the little cars but downstairs we actually have pop it controllers pop it like gaming controllers yes. for each of the kids I think one's pink one's green blue, and black blue green. and black yellow and black yep. pink but yeah they're just like pop it controllers and those are down in the basement so we're gonna put it all back in here and get it out of here <laughs> before the kids get home from school. I am actually going to end this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed seeing what we got. I want you guys to leave me a comment down below. What is going in your kids' stockings? I am curious. If you are not already, please subscribe to our channel and turn your channel notifications on. Definitely go follow us over on our Instagram and our social medias. I will leave all those links down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll talk to you in our next vlog. Bye.